last class we did relation between time period and frequency i think what is wavelength the distance between two consecutive particles the distance between two consecutive particles which are in same state of vibrations the distance between two consecutive particles which are in same state of vibration is called as wave length or distance between consecutive crests or consecutive crests is called as wavelength or distance between consecutive compressions or consecutive rarefactions is called as wavelength right this three definition for wavelength What you have written there? Distance between consecutive crests, consecutive crests, or consecutive troughs. Transverse wave is in form of crest and trough. Yes, yeah. complete it. Done, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Wave number. How many wave you can see? Uh, one. One, two, three wave, na? Distance of one wave is it called wavelength? Distance of one wave is it called wavelength? Yes, sir. Okay. So, 
lambda distance can accommodate one wave okay this lambda distance has how many wave one wave or not come on sir right sir lambda distance has how many wave one wave yes sir so one meter will have how many wave so one wave no one meter will have one wave 10 rupees mein ek pen तो एक रुपए में दस पेन नो सर वन अपॉन टेन हो जाएगा ना यस सर सो वन अपॉन लैमडा दैट मींस नंबर ऑफ वेव प्रेजेंट इन वन मीटर इज कॉल्ड एस वेव नंबर व्हाट इज वेव नंबर नंबर ऑफ वेव प्रेजेंट इन वन मीटर इट इज रेसी प्रोकल ऑफ वेवलेंथ मेजर्ड इन मीटर राइट डेफिनेशन नाम दे दें नंबर ऑफ वेव्स number of waves present in 1 meter is called as wave number number of waves present in 1 meter is called wave number it is reciprocal of wave length measured in meter it is given by new bar this is called new new bar equals to 1 upon lambda and lambda should be measured in meter right right power of lens is 1 upon f measured in meter same way this is 1 upon lambda measured in meter return yes sir okay wave velocity hello hello हेलो 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 गुड मॉर्निंग रंग हाँ 
all the lectures offline i have told already now somebody asked so i told her. our lecture is at better 10:30 no acha acha so i will try to manage in a dual mode well more means i will send a link also you are got ha theek hai theek hai the distance covered by wave in unit time is called as wave velocity the distance covered by wave in unit time is called wave velocity relation between velocity comma frequency comma wavelength Yes, sir. Ah. Uh ah. -huh. Uh, so, today, you have to tell me. After that, next week, sir, na every Wednesday and Sunday test plus revision. Ah, okay. Today, I have light ka thoda formula se bhai. Okay. let lambda be the distance covered by wave in time period capital t what is formula for speed general is it distance upon time Speed formula yes. is distance upon time. Yes. So if distance covered is lambda, then time taken is time period. So I can say speed denoted by v is lambda upon capital T. V equals to lambda upon capital T, but one upon T is denoted by n, which is called frequency. so therefore v equals to n lambda this is the formula right now
Yes, John. Completed. Come on, done. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, yes. So whenever it is wave, one formula we got P is n lambda. There can be different different formulas for velocity, but general for any wave n lambda. Transverse wave. Transverse means perpendicular. So if the wave is traveling on the horizontal, that means x-axis, and particles are vibrating perpendicular to the direction of propagation, then this waves form, they are called transverse wave. So I can say the waves in which particles of medium vibrates perpendicular to the direction of propagation of waves. The waves in which particles of mediums vibrates perpendicular to the direction of propagation of waves are called as transverse waves. The waves in which particles of medium vibrates perpendicular to the direction of propagation of waves are called as transverse waves, right? Done. Yes, completed. Yes. Now yes. Let's get characteristics of transverse. First. First point, you will write definition in the exam. Second, when transverse waves travels in a medium, then alternately crests and Roughs are formed. So, when transverse wave travels in the medium, alternately crest and troughs are formed. The distance between consecutive crests or troughs is called as wavelength. Fourth, the medium must possess elasticity of shape 
because crest becomes trough again regains and becomes crest so it possess elasticity of shape and inertia for propagation of transverse wave right four point Completed four points. Done. Sixth. See, if this is crest. After some time, it will become trough. Uh, this crest will move ahead. It will become trough. Then again crest, again trough. This way, it will keep on propagating. so only the shape is getting inverted and then again reinverted that means this volume 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 is returning back so same volume either in up or in down direction volume same mass same means density same and pressure forces same area same pressure is same so when transverse wave travels in a medium then pressure and density remains unchanged pressure and density remains unchanged sixth they can travel through solids comma surface of liquids but not through gases because gas do not has definite volume seventh they can be 
प्लेन पोलराइज मीनिंग इफ द पार्टिकल इज वाइब्रेटिंग अलॉन्ग वाई एक्सिस वेव इज ट्रेवलिंग अलॉन्ग एक्स इट इज ट्रांसफोर्स ऑल्सो वेन पार्टिकल इज वाइब्रेटिंग अलॉन्ग जेड एंड वेव इज ट्रेवलिंग अलॉन्ग एक्स टिल ट्रांसफोर्स but if you can restrict the motion of the particle only in one plane then it is called plane polarized so it can be plane polarized right this three points again in exam they will ask distinguish between transverse and longitudinal wave so four points you have to write for transverse and four for longitudinal आज नेक्स्ट थोड़ा डाउन है हां अच्छा वो वो सेकंड हाफ में लेते हैं इसको रखते हैं क्या बस निफ्टी निफ्टी नीचे में लेने के अच्छा
is completed. Done, sir. The waves in which particles vibrates parallel to the direction of propagation of waves are called as longitudinal waves. Right. Characteristics, first point, definition will come. Second point, the distance between consecutive compressions or consecutive rarefactions is called as wave length. Third point. The medium gets divided alternately into compressions 
and rarefactions when longitudinal wave travels through the medium. Right again, first three point. The medium must possess elasticity of volume and inertia for propagation of longitudinal waves. The pressure from a density gets changed when longitudinal waves travels through medium. They can travel through solids, from a liquids, from a gases. They do not exhibit phenomenon of plane polarization.
रिटर्न यस रिटर्न हेलो यस डॉक्टर नेक्स्ट रिटर्न न्यूटन्स formula for velocity of sound in a medium and explain why it was discarded for gas Newton's formula for velocity of sound in a medium, and then we have to explain why it was discarded in case of gases. According to Newton, velocity of sound in a medium is given by b equals to root of e upon rho where e is modulus of elasticity and rho is density of medium so newton told that or found that Velocity of sound in a medium can be stated as root of e by rho. This is in general for any medium. Then we'll see for solid, we'll see for liquid, we'll see for gas, and we'll explain why it was discarded. Copy this much. नेक्स्ट क्लास विल बी नाउ फ्रॉम कमिंग वी एवरी वेनेसडे एंड संडे हाँ यू विल हैव टेस्ट प्लस रिवीजन टेस्ट प्लस रिवीजन सो टू डेज आई एम कॉलिंग यू या एवरी आई विल सेंड एंटर डिटेल टू डेज सिक्स दैट्स व्हाई आई कॉल ऑल द स्टूडेंट सो दैट वी कैन डिस्कस आउट Ah. No, no. You all are having test also on that day. So uh, I, I will just send a timetable. After the test, I will keep for you so that you are free with everything. Now, so when you are coming at a stretch, you are or uh, everything will get over. Yes, yes. Yeah.
bitter. Yes, then. Okay. So this is general E by rho. For solids, E is Y, which is called as Young's modulus. We have done in chapter called mechanical properties of solid. So B equals to root of Y by rho in solid. For fluids, that is liquids and gases modulus of elasticity is called as bulk modulus k. Therefore, B equals to root of k by rho. He further assume that okay please copy this much we further assume that in gases first complete this then we'll see what he assumed Yes, then this also till this, he further resumed that in gases. Yes, done. Hello? Hello, hello, hello. Done? Yes, yes, done. So he assumed that in gases, compression and rarefaction changes very slowly which is actually wrong like sound cusp 348 can't be slow changes very slowly and gets time to exchange heat with the surroundings and gets time to exchange heat with the surroundings Thus, the process is isothermal and for isothermal process, for isothermal process, K equal to gamma p where gamma equal to cp upon cb cp comma cb are specific heats at constant pressure and 
वॉल्यूम रिस्पेक्टिवली कॉपी दिस मच Done. CP upon CD. Just write down this value is one point four one. Therefore, for gases, V will be root of gamma P by rho. So at NTP. B equals to gamma one point four one. Atmospheric pressure is point seven six meter height of mercury thirteen thousand six hundred into nine point eight, and rho is one point two nine three for air. This is found to be approximately two seventy nine point nine meter per second, but experimentally. it is found that velocity of sound in air is 330 meter per second hello ha sir ha bas ek 10:30 baje aaunga ha ha milenge sir wo detail de dijiye na mujhe aadhar card aur pan card हाँ आधार कार्ड पैन हाँ डिटेल चाहिए होगा और वो चेक्स चाहिए और आ, बस क्योंकि वो नंबर लिखना पड़ेगा ना उसमें ठीक है हाँ चलेगा मैं आप आ, मैं, मैं आप कब कितने बजे तक बोलो तो मैं टेन थर्टी से लेके आगे दो बजे तक बोलू विच वन हाँ 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 मैं उधर क्लास में ही हूँ आप जब फ्री होंगे तो खाली एक मिस्ड कॉल दे देना मैं अरेंज कर नो प्रॉब्लम नो प्रॉब्लम नो प्रॉब्लम ठीक बाय इस थ्री थर्टी मीटर पर सेकेंड विच इज नॉट इन क्लोज एग्रीमेंट of experimentally found value hence it was discarded in for gases because ana che answer 340 30 ka aas pass mein he proved it is 279.9 kya mistake kiya usne He told it is slow process, but actually it is not slow. It is fast process. Yes, complete.
return so okay so that's all for today next class is for the time to will be meet in one lecture theory of this chapter will get over